Welcome back to another Bokking tutorial. Today I'm going to go over the rendering settings for the camera, as well as show you a Steam Guide that I made, so that if you're mobile or don't have access to the engine for whatever reason, you can still go through the rendering settings and see one that you might be thinking about at that moment. And with that said, let's get started. So there are a couple ways to adjust rendering settings in your project. First, you can go to the camera tool and you can select the camera that you want, and then you can go to edit rendering settings. Here you can actually micromanage each property if you want. Ash has a video where he goes over all of these properties. I would strongly recommend watching that for those. The other thing is, is that it has a bunch of presets and you can just start clicking down these presets and seeing which one fits your particular theme that you need in your game. All right. So I'll just stick with daytime. This is the first way to change rendering settings. The next way is that you can go into an event here and we can change the rendering setting on the fly. So if we click the plus button, we can go to screen effects and we can go down to change rendering settings. And here we can select from that pre-made list of rendering settings. So if we wanted to go to say a darkness or underworld, let's just say, we can click okay, we can play test. And as soon as the game starts, it's going to go to a underworld rendering. All right, and just in case you don't have access to the camera tool rendering settings where you can preview these, say that you're mobile or something, but you really wanna remember what one looked like, I have made a Steam Guide that you can scroll down and see every setting that there is with an example. You can also just go to the top here, hit Control F and type in day, and it will give you all the ones that are daytime. Or if you remember specifically, you wanted an Ice World one, there are the Ice World ones. Hopefully you found this video useful. Like, subscribe for more content. If you have any questions, comments below. Steam Forms will get you figured out. And with that said, I'll see you at the next video.